Welcome back everyone. Happy Independence Day. Today's dish is going to be another Anglo-Indian recipe. It's called the Jolly Fry. This is a dry and spicy dish. However, you can increase or decrease the amount of chili that's used in this. Come, let's check out how this is done. Firstly, we'll need three tablespoons of cooking oil, and once that's hot, we'll need three to four red chilies split in half. Just saute them for about a few seconds, and then we'll need two large onions, thinly sliced. About the dry red chilies, you can deseed them if you don't want it to be too spicy. I've deseeded a couple of them, not all of them though. And uh, yeah, you can increase the amount of red chilies too if you'd like. We'll need to fry down the onions well. They need to caramelize a bit. I'm adding a pinch of salt to fasten the frying process. This recipe is a very simple and easy uh, recipe to make. If you're in a hurry to make a, a good uh, chicken dish, then this is the way to go about it. Uh, you don't need much of uh, masalas or much of ingredients. Just a couple of ingredients will do. The onions are beginning to turn into a golden brown color. Now let's add quarter of a teaspoon of turmeric. I'm adding 1 teaspoon of Kashmiri red chilli powder. Let's saute that well on low heat. Now let's add in the chicken drumsticks. I'm adding about 450 grams of chicken here. If you want this uh, dish to be a bit more sweeter, then you can add more in onions. Now let's add one cup of water and let the chicken cook on low heat, on low to medium heat. The chicken has cooked well. Now we will need to dry this gravy down. Let's keep frying this till all the gravy has evaporated. Make sure to check your seasonings at this stage. Add some salt if necessary. The gravy has dried down well and now it's uh, beginning to coat the chicken. Once the oil starts to separate from the gravy, that's when you know it's done. So we can take it down and plate it. I've laid this delicacy on a bed of lettuce and garnished it with some fresh coriander leaves. This chicken recipe can be served with rice and uh, pepper water or rasam. That's the most famous uh, Anglo-Indian combination. Or oh, it can also go well with uh, biryani as a side dish. Or you can even enjoy this with fresh hoppers. Thanks for watching guys. Hope you like this recipe. Do try it out. Also, if you like this video, share, subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. See you in my next video. Take care and bye-bye.